guys, for dinner we got Jinya. It is a ramen spot. So I got uh, tonkatsu black and Vario got the spicy chicken ramen. I'm so excited. This ramen is so, so good. So they just put it, when you get it to go, they put it in different um, containers for you. And I'm about to set mine right on up. And I also added corn. Ugh, I love adding corn. So excited. All right, guys, so Vario decided that we should have a date today. So he mm -hmm. came over to DC mm -hmm. and we got our favorite Italian food from um, this place in DC. <laughs> we got our Caesar salad. Yeah, Osteria Alvolvo. And then uh, Caesar salad, carbonara for both of us, and the bread. And the Washington Monuments over there. Let's get to see it. Beautiful evening. Quarantine edition. Guys, we're thinking about getting a grill today so we can grill out on our back porch. This is what we're looking at. It's a really good price. All right, so we're getting this grill. We're getting our little essentials, grill cover. Got these grill chips. That's the goods. All right, guys, the grill is finally and I haven't shown you guys our backyard uh, back patio set. It's from Target, Project 62 brand. All right, so this is what we have so far. It's very good. I want cheese on all the burgers. Huh? Cheese on all the burgers. Mm, these burgers are so good. I don't know, steak is really good. So I also just made some roasted corn and roasted asparagus. This would be good for like meal prep throughout the week, I think, to add some veggies to our our meals. And then we also have our made up meat. Those cheeseburgers and steak was amazing. And the hot dogs were really good. And these are the chicken wings that I'm gonna barbecue up for another time. They're all nice and crispy. Did you like the grill? Yeah, I love it. Good morning guys, it is April 20th and I am about to just mix myself some Lipton black tea. This is my favorite bar I was downstairs listening to his podcast, loud as hell. But um, yeah, just making this. Sometimes I just like hot warm tea in the morning and that is what is happening this morning. Good morning everyone. Metro's over there eating his breakfast. All right guys, so it's lunchtime. I'm about to make the wings that I grilled yesterday. So I'm literally just gonna pop them in the oven just to get them warm. Um, they're in the refrigerator, so they're kind of cold right now. I'm gonna pop them in the oven just to get them warm. And then after a little bit, I'm gonna put the barbecue sauce mixture that I'm gonna do on top. And then I'm going to broil them so that they're nice and barbecued up. And I'll probably have this with some grilled asparagus from yesterday. But I wanted to show you guys how I'm going to make the sauce. So I already have uh, Sweet and Spicy by Sweet Baby Ray's. I'm literally just making this up as I go. Um, I'm going to add some ketchup, which is in here. Ketchup, Sweet Baby Ray's sauce. And I'm also going to add, what else, what else? Some brown sugar. That's what I'm going to get. All right. And then we'll just season it up as I go. I really don't know what I'm going to add to this yet, so wish me luck. All right, here's my food. Hot dog from last night. These are the barbecue chicken wings and asparagus. Looks so good. See how this is. Yeah. Welcome to Teddy Riley. Baby face. Live. All right, good morning, guys. It is Tuesday, um, April 21st. Metro's over there living life. I did get a card today from my friend Geraldine. Thanks so much. We got a little congratulations card. So nice to get some. Oh, it's from Trader Joe's. I didn't even see that. Very cool. 
Um, so thank you so much, Geraldine. Love this card. Such a nice little touch for our new house. Um, this little boy over here is in a bed of toys and sweaters. You're in a bed of toys and sweaters? Yeah, my boy. So guys, just coming back at you to shout out to everyone that has subscribed to my channel, commented, liked, watched my videos. Thanks so much. It's literally just the best feeling in the world for people to watch like your content. And I'm just so excited. So you guys really like the empty house tours. I've gotten so many good compliments and congratulations. So just thank you guys so much. Vario and I are just so happy to see everyone happy for us. So that's really awesome. And shout out to all my new subscribers. Literally, I actually have like comments to respond to and like I'm actually seeing the views going up. So shout out to everyone that has found my channel and decided to stick around. I really do appreciate it. It's awesome. Thank you guys so much. Virtual hugs. Alright guys, I had a craving so I made some Rice Krispie treats. I haven't had these in forever. I don't remember the last time I made these, but I'm so excited. Yum. Good morning guys. It is Wednesday, April 22nd. I am about to whip up a fruit salad kind of thing so we can use it and eat it during the days while we're home. Um, the only problem is my mangoes aren't all the way ready, but let me grab my kiwis. So this is what we have. I'm going to be putting bananas, kiwis, some lime juice, cut up some strawberries and some blueberries in a bowl and then it'll be all put together. I'm going to use lime juice and lemon to make like a nice sweet little syrup on top. But that's going to be my fruit bowl, fruit salad basically. Okay guys, so I'm getting into uh, saving food that I see on Instagram to like my food collection and i saved this fruit bowl some weeks ago i don't even know when oh, this was posted in december so it was a while ago but i'm finally gonna make it so i'm gonna make this fruit bowl and cut up all my strawberries put you know all that crap in there let's do it all right guys so i've cut up all the fruit um and put it in this bowl now i'm making the little juice that goes on top with some limes and some honey and i'm just uh, mixing that up together all right, I poured the sauce over and now we're going to mix it all through. Yum, so good. It smells amazing. And there we have it. I'm just missing my mangoes, of course, but we'll add those in. This is good enough fruit and it's a humongous bowl of fruit. Okay, so see how big that bowl is next to this but yummies okay guys just transferred it into this bowl so i could put it back in the refrigerator but i just tasted it and it tastes so so good the lime juice in there oh my gosh definitely make this if you guys have some fruit lying around so you can just grab it and go in the morning it's so good guys so tonight is a crock pot meal i am making chili in the crock pot um this recipe is so good i've had it before but i already browned the meat and I put all the seasonings on top and now I'm just going to mix everything together. We've got black beans, bushes baked beans, onions, tomato sauce, brown sugar is the key ingredient because it makes it sweeter. Uh, garlic is in there. Lots of good stuff. So yeah, I'm just going to mix that up and then this is going to cook for four to six hours. Yummy. Guys, here's how the chili turned out. It looks so good, so rich in flavor. I just topped it with some cheese, green onions, and sour cream. And that's for dinner tonight. Okay, so we got Thai for lunch. I got some crab um, fried rice. Barrio got pineapple fried rice. And then we also always get the uh, fried wontons with this like carrot sauce. Yummy. I got crab fried rice. Mm. So we are grilling out again. Our temperature is at 300. Let's see. Mmm. Got burgers, hot dogs, hamburgers, and steaks. So excited. This is our little set. I don't know if I showed you guys, but I got this patio set from Target. I'm obsessed with it. It's by the Project 62 brand. So now we just need to get an umbrella. We're going to get a black one. 
and I really love this set. I got it on a really good sale, and the seats like recline back three times, which gives it, you know, options. This is our little patio right now. All right, guys, this is our final um, outcome. We got some hot dogs, cheeseburgers that I made with some leftover meat, and Barrio got some steak this week, so we just put it on the grill. It looks so good. Getting better at the grill. Huh? You getting better at the grill? I'm trying to, I'm trying to. I'm gonna be good too. This looks awesome, so juicy. And Mechi wants some. All right guys, here's my food. We're gonna be eating outside today. So nice. Here it comes by. Vibes. Body. Uh, body. Money in the bank. In the bank. Mm. Y'all see this? I went from a goatee to looking like. So what's gonna be on the next Barrios Corner? People are wondering. You know, I've been thinking about that. I was actually talking to my dad about the Barrios Corner. I think this time I'm gonna also talk about. I, th I really think it's a good topic to talk about what sites when you order stuff from, what size to get. Because there are some sites that we all shop on that the stuff is really big and then other sites where the stuff is super small. Uh, it's going to be something like that. It's going to be about self-care during quarantine and, uh, you know, how to balance your work day to your leisure time. I think that's what I'm going to talk about. Okay. Yeah. Um, she turned the camera on me after I've been drinking barrel whiskey, so... That's why I keep looking at the. I'm looking at the record, the sign right here instead of looking at the camera. That's how I look at my right hair. Now. Okay. That's how I drunk <laughs> right now. I'm looking up there instead of looking. Like this. All right, guys. So we're having a little bit too much fun out here. Oh my god, I look like I'm gaining weight. No, you're not. Yes, I do. Oh my god. Okay. Maybe. Okay. All right. Good morning, guys. This morning I am repurposing the steak we had last night to make steak and eggs. This is my little setup, and I'll show you guys when it's all done. Yummies! All right, guys, here's our plates. Um, I made a spinach scramble with like onions and spinach, um, an egg scramble with onions and spinach, and that's the steak. I just put it on broil to heat it up, and here's mine. I'm just gonna have some oatmeal on the side, and Barrio's gonna have some toast. But doesn't that look so good? It smells amazing in here. All right, guys, so I just made dinner. I made, pa oh my god, mozzarella. <laughs> pesto chicken it's so good it's like chicken caprese or whatever it's just really good flavors i always like pesto and tomatoes and cheese so that's what that is and then this are these are my favorite potatoes to make they are roasted garlic parmesan butter roasted potatoes they're so so good i make them every time i make this dish so it's just like goes together really well like if I'm making this, I have to make this. So that's what's on top of here is just like some roasted garlic that I had in the oven for like 40 minutes, roasted it down and then melted that with butter um, and then poured it over top and let them bake up. They're so, so good. Um, I'll leave a link to both of these recipes below. I've made it before on my channel, but just in case you haven't seen that video, I will link that again. So, so good. Literally, and it's so easy. Make it, make it. So excited to eat this. I'm about to try it now. Let's see the potato. This potato. I turn this light off. Which one? That one. Yeah. Now it looks better. Okay, let's try it. Mm. So good literally the garlic on it is amazing let's try the chicken make it a this humongous knife that i have looks really nice and juicy let's do it this just came out so it's very hot Hot. 
Mm. Even though it's hot, this is so good. Mm. The cheese. See who's waiting for me. Give him food. Can have this. So good, guys. Definitely try this recipe. It is amazing. It's one of my favorites to make, and it's so, so easy. Try it out. Let me know if you try it out and if you like it. Literally, guys, it's just so good. So nice and juicy. Mm, mm, mm. And show you guys these cookies I made yesterday. They're lemon almond cookies. They're so good. I'll definitely leave the recipe down below, but I'm going to eat some more of these as I made a lot of batter. These are so, so good. Like fresh lemon. I also use gluten-free flour, so... It's kind of, it has less sugar too, less sugar too, which helps it being, you know, more healthy. So it's not as bad as the general cookie, but these are so good. All right, guys. So for our little pre-dinner or maybe dinner, um, sorry, we made shrimp egg rolls courtesy of our friend Shani. She gave us this recipe from Pinterest and these look so good. My mom just, I sent her a picture and she was like, did you make that? Like, yeah, we made this. This looks so good. This is going to start our, um egg roll inspired recipes because these were very easy to use and they fried up very nice and then this is the dipping sauce i'll definitely include the recipe in the link below are you excited mm -hmm. i'm really crush all right guys we're gonna try it out for you guys on the recorder mm -hmm. all right here one two three mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. Yum. It was just a fire. They're hot, but really good. They're great. The sauce is really nice and sweet. Mm. Mm. Nice and crunchy. Mm hmm. See, the shrimp is nice and seasoned. I can taste it. Mm. Oh, so hot. These are very easy to make too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you made know, the smallest one you can make. <laughs> you see what you just did there? Well, you said I made the smallest amount I can make. Yeah, like you made like a. Uh, <laughs> that was the re recipe. Mm. For all these. I don't know what the Chinese restaurant. As good as these. You oh. definitely don't have as many shrimp. You jippy you on the shrimp. Chinese restaurant have an egg roll like this long with like two shrimp in there. You be like, bro, where are all the shrimp at? Mm. Great. I already made this big one. It's like a chimichanga. Look at those colors, yes. So guys, I just got done working. I'm gonna close this bad boy and this little guy is just so tired. Oh my goodness, look at that chihuahua tongue hanging out. He is a tired little boy. Um, outside of that, I've work been working on my final project. Um, I don't even think I said hello today. Hello, it is um, Monday, April 27th. And um, basically I am in my last week of grad school this week. So I'm so happy. It's my last week. I can't believe it. So I'm like officially done on Sunday, but pretty much I'm done on Friday because that's when my big project is due. And then, um, yeah that's when like the main stuff is going to be due and i'm so excited so happy i cannot wait to be done with school i'm so excited um so yeah uh i've been working on my final presentation i have to do um a presentation and then record it and then do a paper 
and then in my accounting class I have to do a discussion post and an assignment and that's it for my master's degree work that sounded like a lot didn't it but yeah um super excited about that it's really nice outside today it's been it was really rainy earlier but now it looks very nice outside so i was about to just step outside for a little bit and sit down on the porch um this little guy's gonna follow me when i go out there so he's a sweet little boy little boy good afternoon guys I wanted to pop on and show you guys what I just made for lunch really quick I picked up these salmon burgers these like fresh salmon burgers from Wegmans um, on Sunday and I just wanted to use them today so this is me using them and I'll show you guys what I did so I wanted to make it healthy so I made each one up on the pan you can grill these two if you would rather I know on the grill they would be amazing but we didn't have the grill hooked up to, or running today so I just put them on the pan and then I topped uh, underneath is just romaine cut up um, and then I put tomatoes, some red onion and some Mexican blend cheese and then I just put the salmon burger on top. I just cut them in half so it fit in the bowl nicely. I'm so excited to try this and then I think I'm just going to be using this um, salad dressing. It's the Parmesan and roasted garlic by Newman's Own and then Vario likes croutons so we'll probably put that on his. But yeah, doesn't that look so nice and fresh? Yum. Yeah. 